Good sex never makes you feel hollow. I'm absolutely obsessed with good sex. Like it's okay. the good sex, you know, it makes me want to dance. So if, if good sex um, doesn't make you feel hollow and <clears throat> doesn't make you feel clean, what does it make you feel? I'm coming at it from a love song perspective. I'm coming at it from a perspective of trying to stay together through all that is too much in our society and all the pressures that get put on the bedroom, the pressures that get put on people and sort of instant accessibility to porn and how the younger generations are really starting to think that this is exactly what intimacy is. And mm -hmm. it's not. And it's not all about the money shot. It's also about the spoon and the hold and the breath and the breathing. Good sex it's gonna get you in the fun line. Good sex it's gonna die. The video is unbelievable. It got Thank us you. a little bit hot and flustered. It's you know, like, yeah, it's that's good. in a beautiful kind of way, though. In a not beautiful in a, way, not in a provocative way. And when we put them on the table, the light tables, and we just played the record, and we stood outside. I don't know. I couldn't watch them. So where was your partner? Exactly. Where I'm was yours? So lost. I'm alone. Um, lust is a good thing. But you just said it's the opposite. Yeah. Hey, everything in moderation. Yep. You know. If you're gonna have handcuffs and peanut butter at your bedside table, make sure that you're in a safe environment. Right? That's right. <laughs> oh, God, that was good. That was a good one. Okay, good. Yeah? Take that one home, kids. Yeah.